there are over 500,000 new cases of cervical cancer that occur in the world each year, and about over 260,000 deaths. Unfortunately, the vast majority of those new cases and deaths occur among women who live in the poorest countries in the world. So most of my work in the past has been in helping the Zambian government establish cervical cancer screening programs. And we've been successful over the past 10 years in screening over 600,000 women. The government of Zambia is going to launch the HPV vaccination program for young school-aged girls in June of this year. I think that is going to be revolutionary and critical to, this, to the elimination of this disease. The HPV virus is the cause of cervical cancer. The commercial vaccines that exist on the market today, which are extremely safe, have been shown to effectively prevent young girls before sexual intercourse of acquiring the HPV virus. So the vaccination really represents the ultimate solution to the problem. However, Hundreds of thousands of women are already infected with the HPV virus, and so they need to be screened for cervical cancer. The last thing I'm doing is to train young doctors in Sub-Saharan Africa, Zambia, Malawi, and other places how to perform proper cancer surgery on women who are found to have early stage cervical cancer, which can be cured if the proper surgery is done.